Welcome. I'm going over the official October 2020 SAT test, so I can get you ready for the SAT. Now let's move to section four, second section for the math with the calculator. Number one. 2n equals negative 22. Which value of n satisfies the given equation if we divide by 2 on both sides? n equals negative 11. So the answer is B. Number two, the ratio of trumpet to violin in a particular music classroom is 1, 2, 3. So trumpet 1, violin 3. If there are 9 trumpet, how many violin are here? So using a cross multiplication, one times x is x, three times nine equals 27. So the answer is gonna be 27, D. Question three and four refer to the following information. We know the, uh, in our battle is the amount of light reflected from the surface divided by the amount from the surface divided by the amount of light falling on the surface. And this here show the minimum, show the maximum. For number three, for which of the following services is the range of our bellows be the greatest? From what we look at here, we know the snow has 0 0.84 minus 0 0.41 will be 0 0.43. So we know this one the biggest uh, range here, D. Number four, in a desert region, the amount of sunlight falling on the surface with the area of square root meter is 1000 watts. Which of the following could be the amount of sunlight in watts? Let's look at this uh, table here. We know which one close to the uh, 27. We have 26 and 29. So we have times 20, 0 0.26 equals 2600. Now let's look here. That's the desert. So we're looking for this 275 is close to this and belong to the range. So the answer will be A, 275. Number five, the table shows the distribution by breed and sex of dogs that received a vaccine from veterinary during the month of July. So we have male, female, and American uh, fox hen. If a male box dog that received a vaccine during the month of July is selected at random, What's the probability that a dog breed is Alaskan Malamute? So we have Malamute and Miro going to be six. And uh, out of six plus four, that's the uh, Miro dogs. So be six over 10 equals 0 0.60. Number six, of the following, which is the most appropriate linear model for the given data? So we, we know we x equals zero, y equals 7, and then when x equals 0, y equals 0, x equals 7, y equals 0. So we know that, we, that means x plus 1 equals 7. So we know this answer is going to be the perfect answer. We subtract x on both sides. So y equals 7 minus x. Number 7, the area of a square is 36 square inches. What's the length in inches? Of the side of square 36 square is going to be 6 so the answer is going to be B 36 number 8 the graph shows the average heart rate for 15 people before and during after a period of strenuous exercises the horizontal axis shows timing minutes this is time and horizontal vertical axis shows the average heart rate in beats per minute uh, approximately how many minutes did it take after the exercise period ended for the average heart rate before reach normal before the exercise period began? So let's see here. We finish at approximately 15 minutes and then come to normal around 24. So 24 minus 15 is 9. So the answer is A. Number 9. Makila opens a bank account that earns interest at a rate of 2% compounded annually. She did not do any, she put $200 in the account when she opens it and does not make any more deposits into or withdraw from the account for two years. If the amount of money in the account after two years is given by the expression of 200 times 
from this 1.02 to the second power, which is the following expression giving the amount of money in the uh, account after one year. That means 200 times 1.02 less the base times the exponent. So the answer is going to be B. Number 10. If 3x equals 8y and both x and y are positive, what's which of the following equals 40y? So we know from 8y to 40y, we times 5. So 3 times 5 will make 15x. So the answer will be 15x will be D. Number 11. Based on the model, how many teachers are predicted to be in the high school? So we know the going to be ST equals 80 plus number n times so it will be every year so we're going to be plus the answer is going to be 95 because every year we have 2017 minus 2002 so it'll be 15 so it'll be 90 plus 15 will make it 95 and which of the following of the of the graph is function s so we know this answer is 12 80 and start from here between 1200 to 1400 every year we have 15 plus more so we're going to leave the graph going up a little bit by 15 so the answer is going to be a this is the original problem here the given equation model the number of teachers and students in the high school so t n equals 80 plus n s n equals 1280 plus 30 n based on the model what's the first year in which the predicted number of teacher will be greater than 90 so we have t equals 80 plus n so we have to be over 90 so it'll be 2002 plus 11 will be 2013 because the last is over 11 plus 80 will make 91 so it'll be over 90. number 14 the table above shows the mass of in kilometers and length in centimeters of the largest known species of turtles and tortoises, the mean mass of the nine turtles and tortoises is approximately 331 kilogram. The mass of Aldebra giant tortoise is close to the mean mass. Which of the following is true about the length of the Aldebra giant turtles? Let's see here. We have we know this. We're gonna use the lambda map. Remember, you have a data set. You need lambda map from we have 81, 95, 100, 100, then we have 140, 150, we have 187, 210, and 213. Let's see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. We're looking for the median, it has to be the one in the middle. So, Median is going to be 140, and from the, from the table here, we know the uh, Aldebra giant turtle is 150. So we know 150 is 10 more than 140, so it's it's 10 centimeters longer than the median length. Number 15. Data set A and data set B. Each of the box plots shown summarize a data set. Data set A has a range of 130 and data set B has a range of 80. If the two data set are combined into one data set, what's the range of combined data set? We know that data B is 160 and data A from is the 10. So we have 160 minus 10 is 150. So the answer will be C. 150. At the beginning of the study, the number of bacteria in the population is 150,000. The number of bacteria doubled every hour for the limited period of time. So we know this is going to be 150,000. Double will be the base number be 2 to the exponential x. So the answer is going to be in y equals b. Okay, b equals 150,000 times 2 to the second to the x power point. Number 17. Y equals x plus 3 times x minus 7 and also y equals x minus 7. So if fx is a solution to the given system of the equation, which of the following 
could be the value of x. Let's solve the equation by substitute. We have x plus 3, x minus 7 equals x minus 7 using the FOIA method. So x squared plus 3x minus 7x minus 21 equals x minus 7. x squared, combine this one being negative 4x minus 21 equals x minus 7. So we try the x on both sides. So x squared minus 5x, then we, we plus 7 on both sides, be negative 14 equals 0. And we know the 2 times 7 will be 14, we next we have negative x plus 2 times x minus 7, because this negative 7 is bigger, so the answer will be x equals negative 2, x equals positive 7. So let's look at this answer here. We know the answer is going to be D. Number 18. The speed of light body is approximately 320 million feet per second. What's the speed in yard per minute? You are equal for 3, so we have 320. Because we have 60 minutes in a second. 60 seconds in a minute, so we're going to multiply 60 and then divide by 3, we'll get the answers. So 3 going to 60, 20 times. 320 times 20, 0, 4, 0. 6 times 2 times 3 is 6. So the 6400 million. So the answer is 6400 million. Number 19. ST equals 150 AD T squared minus 771T plus 10,268. The sum of students enrolled in these 13 university T years up to 1969 can be modeled by this function as above. If O is less than T, less than 33. So the constant term 10,268 in the function is an estimate, estimate for the width of the folly. So we know from the, this is the first year, if the T equals zero, that means the first year, the answer is going to be the number of students enrolled in 1969. Number 20. A company found that the average customer rating of the certain product can be used to estimate the total income from that product according to. So y equals 44x plus 500. Now let's do the question here. Which of the following best describe the slope of the graph? So 44. So we know every time you increase by any number the x the income will increase 44. So we know the answer for every increase of one in the average customer rating, the estimate increase income is 44. So it's going to be D, 44. Number 21, 2x minus y equals 3, 4x minus y equals 3. So how many solutions does the system equation have? So we can use equation 2 subtract as equation 1. So 4x minus y minus 2x plus y equals 3 minus 3 equals 0 so y and y cancels out so 4x minus 2x is 2x equals 0 so x equals 0 and y we're going to put x in 0 in the system so 2 times 0 minus y equals 3 so y equals negative 3 so the solution will be 0 and negative 3 so one solution number 22 the graph of y equals r x is shown in the graph x y plane. If a, b, c are positive constant, which of the following could define the function r? If we know the parabola is going to be upside down, so that's only the maximum, that means this one has to be negative. And so c and d are out. And then also here, the x has to be a x minus b, make it towards over here make it positive here so the answer has to be a number 23 which of the following is the equivalent to the expression so x2 second power minus 2 divided by x minus square root 2 so x square minus 2 will be x minus square root 2 times x plus square root 2 x minus square root 2 so this cancels out so x plus square root 2 so the answer is going to be the one left over here x plus square root 2 number 24 
which of the following represent the positive number R increased by 5%? So R plus 0.05 R, so 1R plus 0.05R equals 1.05R. So the answer is going to be C. Number 25. What's the median of the data set summarizing the frequency table? For frequency table, we need to make a frequency table here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So for number value 1, we have 1. For number 2, we have 4. For number 3, we have 2. For number 4, we have 3. For number 5, we have 7. Now we're going to cross out the one we do not need. There's a five here. One, two, three, four, five. Let's cross out. Then we have a two here. So we have left over will be four. So the answer will be four for increasing. So it's C equals four. Number 26. An airplane uses approximately five gallons of fuel per mile flown. In the plane, if the plane has 60,000 gallons of fuel, so 60,000 gallons at the beginning of the trip and flies 50, 550 miles per hour. Which of the following function estimate the amount of remaining fuel? That means 60,000 gallons minus 550 times 5. That's the uh, the one the fuel used. So 550 times 5 equals 2,750T. So the answer will be 60,000 minus 2750 T. So the answer is going to be D. Number 27. We have a function 3x squared plus bx plus 5 equals 0. For the quadratic function shown, b is a constant. If the equation has no real solution, which of the following must be true? No solution, that means the discriminator or the square root has to be a negative number. So b squared minus 4ac is less than 0. So we have b squared minus 4a is 3, c is 5, so less than 0. b squared, 4 times 3 times 5 is 60, so less 60 equals 0, less than 0. b squared less than 60. So we know the answer from b squared is less than 60. This is 8. Number 28. Line Q and R in the plane X Y plane are perpendicular and intersect at the origin. If line R passes through 1k, what's the equation of R? So let's find the slope of R first equals k minus 0, 1 minus 0. So the answer is going to be slope for the R is going to be k. So we know the Q has to be line Q has to be negative 1 over k. So the answer is going to be b y equals negative x divided by k. Number 29. In the figure, the circle has center O. What's the area of the city region? So we'll, let's look for the area of the arc first. So arc A, O, B. The, remember, this is 60 degrees and the circle is 360, so it'll be 1 6 of the circle pi r squared equals 1 over 6 pi the r is going to be 4 here so it'll be 16 over 6 pi divide because the even number is going to be 8 over 3 pi so that's the square of the arc now let's looking for the square of the area of the triangle triangle a b o equals half times the base is going to be 3, that's radius 4, times, we know this one be used because it's 30 degrees, so this will be 2, so has, we need looking for the answer of A, let's name the D here, AD, AD, the height will be 4 square minus 2 square, because this side is 4, this is 2, so the height is going to be A square, so 16 minus 4 equals square root of 12 equals we can square the 4 times 3 so it will be 2 square 3 now the area of this area will be 8 3 pi minus 2 to the 
square root of 3. Now, then let's look at the answers. We need to take the 3 out from this one because everything covers the 3, 1 third. That would be 8 pi minus, so here we 2 third. So it will be 4 to the 4 times square root 3. Okay? So it will be 12 square root 3. So the answer is going to be D. Number 30. A survey asked a class of 30 students how many siblings they have. The number of students who have one sibling is three times the number of students A. So we who have two or more siblings. If six students have no siblings, which of the following equations represent this situation? So we have 30 students altogether, and six has no siblings. And then we have number of students have two or three. Then we have the other numbers, the rest have one sibling will be three times n. So it will be n plus three and will be four n plus six equals 30. So that's the answer. So it's going to be C. 4n plus 6 equals 30. Number 31. Delayed departure and arrival by airport. Here is the delayed arrival, delayed departure. The scale plot shows the percent of flight with the delayed departure and percent with the del arrival by departing airport in 10 US airports in a certain one year period. A line of best fit is also shown here. For how many of the 10 airports was the percent of flights with delayed arrival less than predicted by the line of best fit? Remember, if we have best, the line of best fit, anything below this one on the right side is going to be less. So it'll be so we count one, two, three, four, five, six. So the answer will be six. Number 32. The points in the figure shown lies in the same plane. If triangle ABF is congruent to triangle EDG, where angle A corresponding to angle E, angle B corresponding to D, what's the measure in degrees of GCF? Angle GCF. If this one A corresponding to E, so also 65 here, B corresponding to D, so be 75 over here. here. So this is 40, so this also means 40. This is also co corresponding congruent. So we know this triangle is 180, 180 minus 40 minus 40. So the answer is 100. 33. The graph of the equation y equals mx plus b, where many, where m and b are constant, if it is shown in the xy plane. What's the value of m? We can use in the uh, given condition here. We know this one is x1, y1, x2, y2. So the slope is going to be 2 minus negative 1, 2 minus negative 1, divided by 0 minus negative 2. So it will be 2 plus 1 is 3. Negative minus 2 will be positive 2, so the answer is 3 over 2 or 1.5. 3 over 2 or 1.5. Number 34. Ice body is disease in corn that is caused by fungus. An agricultural researcher investigated whether the presence of ice body necessitated treatment of a cornfield within fungus site. The table shows the relationship between the presence of ice spot in the cornfield and the need of using fungicide. According to the table, what function of the cornfield where an ice spot was observed needed fungicide? So we have ice spot, we have 30 here, and the total of uh, observers are 40. So 30 over 40 simplify the zero out will be 3 over 4 or you put 0 0.75. 3 quarter or 0 0.75. Number 35. The line graph shows the total length in miles of a major commercial railroad tracks in the United States from 1916 to 1976. So let's see here. So the average rate of change in the mile per year of the total length of major commercial railroad tracks in the U.S. from 1960 to 1926, so is M. So we have we're looking for the rate of change using the formula 
of the slope also called the rate of change, same thing. So it'll be 421,000 minus 397,000 divided by 26 minus 16 is 10. 421 minus 397, 11 minus 7 is 4, 11 minus 9 is 2. So we have 24,000 divided by 10, so it's 2,400. Okay, so the answer is 2,400. A painting crew painted a total of 20 hours in July. In August, the number of houses the crew painted was 20% more than the number of houses we painted in July. So July, we have 20. August, we have 20 times 1.02, 1.2. 1 20% would be 1.2 equal 24. Now, what fraction of the total number of houses the crew painted in July and August was 20 in August? So we have 24, that's for August, divided by 20, that's July plus 24 this August. So we have 24 over 44. Simplify divided by 2 will be 12 over 22 divided by 2 again. So the answer will be 11, no, 6 over 11. 6 over 11. 37. A car was listed with the price of 12,000, the price increased by P to 9,600. So what's the value of P? So we know 12,000 times P percent equals 9,600. So if we divide by 12,000 on both sides, we'll find the P. So 96 divided by 12, 0.8 but that's P is actually is the uh, discount now with the value is going to be 1 minus 0 0.8 so the is 0 0.2 or 20% moving decimal to the right two places so be 20% number 38 130 plus 5 plus 1 half u minus 4 equal 37 Second function here for the system equation above what's the value of product? So we're looking for the first part times the second part. If we combine the two because this is minus and plus, so if we we add in the equation one plus two, we'll get the answer. So it'll be 130 plus 5 times 2 equals 37 plus 19 because this one as this one going to cancels out. So it'll be 56 divided by 2 on both sides. So 130 plus 5 equals 28. If this is 28, so the 1 of u minus 4 is 37 minus 28 equals 9. So the product is going to be 28 times 9. 8 times 9 is 72. 2 times 9 is 16. 2 times 9 is 18 plus 7 is 25. So the answer is 252. Thank you. I'm all done. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe. Turn on notifications. Thank you.